Welcome to the presentation on functions. What's the point of learning these? Let's begin with a notation. f is the function that maps x onto 3x plus 2. Hence, f of x equals to 3x plus 2. f of 1 means the value of function when x equals to 1. Find the value of function, substitute the number or expression in the brackets for x in the formula. f of x equals to 2x minus 1. So, what's f of 3? Substitute x with 3 and therefore f of 3 equals to 5. In another way, what's SpongeBob with Query Patty? Query Patty is input and what's the output? SpongeBob with function, Query Patty is x, and here comes Harry SpongeBob. For the function g of x equals to 2x minus 1, find the value of x for which g of x equals to 11 and g of x equals to x plus 7. When you are given the value of the function and want to find the value of x, put the formula for the function equal to the number or expression. Then solve the equation to find the value of x. g of x equals to 11 and g of x equals to 2x minus 1. Hence, 2x minus 1 equals to 11 x equals to 6. g of x equals to x plus 7 and g of x equals to 2x minus 1. Hence, 2x minus x equals 7 plus 1 and x equals to 8. Let's move on to composite functions. When two or more functions are combined, that's composite function. For example, the composite function of f of x and g of x may be f of gx or g of fx, but they are both not equal. To find the value of f of gx, find the value of g of x first, then put it in place of x in the formula of f of x. Here's another example. What's the formula for inverse function? Replace f of x with y. Then, rearrange the formula to make x the subject. Replace y with x gives the formula of the inverse function. Inverse formula of t of x. So t of x equals to 5x minus 4 and replace t of x with y, y equals to 5x minus 4. Here you rearrange the x to make it the subject. Hence inverse of t of x equals to x plus 4 over 5. Here are some past year questions and examples. 